It wasn't long after 8 last night, local HEU strikers and their supporters found out a deal had been done and the possibility of a general strike had gone by the boards this time. Local HEU representative Kathy Jessam had these words for the assembled group. Individual executives of the Hospital Employees Union and the BC Federation of Labour have agreed to a memorandum of agreement that will settle this labour dispute province-wide. While the reaction to the deal on scene was somewhat subdued, various faces in the crowd told the story. We want you to go back to our executive and say that's not good enough. We're we unanimous in that. We don't yeah. want it, Kathy. We don't want it, Kathy. Take it back to them. Take it back. Take it back. Many were clearly upset, angry, but united in what Jessam says is their ongoing fight to have the Campbell Liberals voted out of office in an election that's just over a year away. Well, it's not a very good day, but uh, we, uh, we, are, uh, we are still defiant and we are still ready to fight. We uh, have um, taken a deal that is less than, much less than our members deserve. There is no doubt about that. They have been uh, served badly by this government, but uh, this government's going to have to remember this day and, and in 370 days they will remember this day. The strike had a profound effect on elective surgeries in the Northern Health Authority's coverage area, about 200 having been delayed. The elective surgeries could begin as early as Tuesday on a priority basis. Other groups who'd supported the HEU were present last night as well. Wayne Mills is president of the Prince George and District Labor Council. Again, it's the frustration that wants them to stay out if they, if they, if and when they find out what's happened they may, they may decide it's not, a, not, not as bad as they think it is at this point. BC Rail was another provincial operation affected by the picketing here. Don Thorne of the Council of Rail Unions had this reaction to the dispute's end. Well, I think uh, just like uh, fellow brother Wayne uh, Mills said there, uh, everyone's uh, frustrated, uh, disappointed. Um, I think uh, this is just one battle of many that we have to face here. I think we still have the public support here uh, uh, to deal with the other issues with the government. And uh, I think everyone just needs to take some time here, have a breather, uh, soak in uh, the air. more information has to be uh, brought to us and uh, go from there. PPWC Local 25 members employed at North Central Plywood walked off their jobs last Thursday morning to support the HEU. Local President Niels Hansen is none too happy with the Campbell Liberals. I think the government is uh, way out of line. I, should, uh, I guess the people have to uh, wake up and get rid of the Liberals. Simple. They have to, uh, it would have nice to be seen a general strike being called by the BC Fed and, and everybody to go out and uh, get rid of the, uh, uh, this government. Many had expected to awake Monday morning to a near general strike with schools closed, garbage piling up and many government services simply not available. Instead, city facilities were reopened, garbage was being picked up again, and schools were open, albeit without buses. Word is there wasn't enough time to notify